Alright, welcome back to pinballhelp.com. Here we are looking at the inside of the cabinet of the earth shaker. I just pulled the top up. I vacuumed the top. Now I'm kind of looking down inside of it, see what we've got to deal with here. Any of you that have repaired machines before, pulled them out of weird places, will probably go, ah, this is not that bad. At least there's not something dead inside of it. It's pretty filthy, but it could definitely be a lot worse. You know, you pull something out of a barn and it's it's had some creature making a nest. There are definitely some weird stuff. Bizarre stuff with wires here. Obviously the plumb bod tilt is gone. I don't know what that pot is for. Maybe this is adjusts the shaker. There's a shaker right there. Um, lots of, uh, some money. I found 75 cents and quarters. It looks like there's some pennies in here too. And it looks like there's some stuff at the back of the cabinet there. Possibly leg bolts and a ball and some other stuff. I'm going to have to crawl back there and see what's there. And, uh, that's the inside of the case. Let's look at the underside of the playfield. Start up here at the top. Again, this is a new game to me. This is my first time really getting a good look at the Earth Shaker playfield. So I don't know for sure if anything's missing, but I don't see any indication of anything missing. I mean, obviously, some hack job wiring here. Um. Nothing jumps out at me. That's an odd thing on top of that. Is that is that all that goes right there for that plunger that pops up? It just looks like maybe, see there's a hole right here. Is there something supposed to be on the other end of that, like a, a pad of some sort? I don't know. I'll have to look research. There's kind of a newer coil there compared to this one. A little bit older looking. Um, all the brackets up here look good. I don't see any signs of anything heating up or melting or catching fire. I don't see a whole lot of signs of rust. A little corrosion right here. But the nice thing is it doesn't look like water got to this which is really cool. It's been kept dry. The transformer looks good. So aside from a few weird things here and there, you know there's some kind of a patch maybe, there's some piece of electrical tape. So I'm gonna get down there in the bottom and see what's down there before I vacuum. I don't want to pull up any playfield parts into the vacuum. So I'll go over all of these corners and make sure what's there is just stuff that I don't want. And uh, we'll take it from there and uh, remember to follow the blog at pinballhelp.com and we'll see what happens next. Thanks for watching.